The self-compassion break is an informal practice that can be applied anytime during the day, whenever we find ourselves in a moment of stress or especially distress. And it's based on the three components of self-compassion, mindfulness, common humanity, and self-kindness. And it also uses the power of words. So I will lead it now as a little reflection, but in daily life, when difficulties arise, you can just apply it directly. So I'd like you to think of a uh, problem in your life right now, maybe a situation at work or in the relationship, anything that causes you any uneasiness. And clearly visualize the situation and also allow yourself to feel right now, as you think about it, how it feels uh, to have this problem. And now the first component of self-compassion is mindfulness. And that means to be able to say right now that this is a moment of stress. This is a moment of struggle. Feeling in our body how it feels to be in this situation, just to name it, to validate it. Using whatever words feel just right for you. So for example, you can just say, ouch, or, or this hurts, or this is tough. Giving yourself that kind of validation as you might for a friend right now. This situation hurts, this feels bad, this is stressful. Naming it for yourself. So that's the first component. It can often give us a little uh, space or distance from what we're feeling. And then the second is the insight into common humanity, and that is that uh, struggle and stress is a part of living. It's a part of everyone's life. So validating that for yourself. Remembering that. That when we're struggling, that we're not alone that other people would struggle just like me in, in this situation. Stress is a part of living. This is how it feels quite often to be alive. I am not alone. And then finally, part three, or self-kindness, is to just remind yourself that this is an opportunity for compassion. So you could say, may I give myself the kindness that I need? May I be kind to myself? May I treat myself as I would a good friend right now. And then do it. And if you like, you can even imagine that you had a good friend who was 
in exactly the same situation, struggling in exactly the same way. And then thinking, what would I say to that person heart to heart? What would I say? If I just had a minute, what would I say? Perhaps you'd say something like, I'm here for you. I care about you. I understand it's difficult. You can do it. I believe in you. What words would you offer to a friend in this situation? And then seeing if you can offer yourself those same words, same phrases. Treating yourself in the same way as you would treat a good friend who is struggling. That's self-care.